Here are Grandma's 65 forgotten frugal hacks from the 1930s. Save and reuse bacon grease for cooking. Grandma never let bacon grease go to waste. Instead of tossing it, she would strain and store it for later use as a cooking fat. This flavorful fat is perfect for frying eggs, vegetables, or adding depth to soups. Reusing bacon grease reduces the need for oils, making dishes richer while cutting cooking costs. Mend clothes instead of buying new. Extend clothing life by learning simple mending techniques. For small holes, thread a needle and stitch around the edges, pulling tight to close. To reattach buttons, sew through the buttonholes repeatedly, securing with a knot. Patching worn areas prevents further tearing and keeps clothes wearable. Use cloth rags instead of paper towels. Replace paper towels with reusable cloth rags. Cut old shirts or towels into squares, perfect for cleaning and wiping spills. Use them to scrub surfaces, then toss in the laundry for repeated use. Cloth rags handle multiple cleanings and absorb well, saving money and reducing waste. Grow a victory garden to cut grocery costs. Victory Gardens were a countrywide initiative during World War I and World War II where citizens were encouraged to grow their own fruits, vegetables, and herbs to support the war effort. To do this today, choose easy vegetables like tomatoes, lettuce, and carrots and plant in a sunny spot. Water regularly and ensure proper spacing for growth. Harvest as needed, reducing trips to the store and enjoying fresh, healthy produce at home. Patch and repair shoes yourself. Grandma would always fix worn shoes at home to avoid buying new pairs. Use shoe glue to reattach soles, applying evenly and pressing firmly until set. For fabric tears, stitch with strong thread, reinforcing weakened spots. Adding rubber patches to heels prevents further wear. Make bone broth from leftover meat bones. Transform leftover bones into rich, nutritious broth. Place bones in a pot with water, vegetables, and a splash of vinegar to help extract minerals. Simmer for several hours, skimming occasionally. The long cooking time releases collagen and nutrients, creating a flavorful base for soups or stews. Save glass jars for storage. Reuse glass jars for practical, eco-friendly storage. Wash thoroughly, remove labels, and use jars for dry goods, spices, or leftovers. Glass is airtight and doesn't absorb odors, preserving freshness and flavor. This method keeps food organized and reduces waste while cutting down on buying extra containers. Compost kitchen scraps for garden fertilizer. Grandma would always turn kitchen scraps into nutrient-rich compost for the garden. Collect vegetable peels, eggshells, and coffee grounds, adding them to a compost bin or pile. Over time, the material breaks down into humus that enriches soil. This process reduces waste and boosts plant growth. Use vinegar as an all-purpose cleaner. Vinegar is a versatile, effective cleaner. Mix equal parts vinegar and water in a spray bottle, then use on glass, countertops, and floors. Its natural acidity cuts through grime and disinfects surfaces safely. Vinegar's cleaning power makes it an affordable, non-toxic alternative to chemical cleaners. Bake bread at home. Homemade bread is budget-friendly and healthier. Combine flour, water, yeast, and salt, then knead and let rise before baking. Fresh baked bread is free from preservatives, offering better flavor and nutrition than store-bought options. Use a clothesline instead of a dryer. Drying clothes on a clothesline saves energy and extends fabric life. To do this, hang each garment by its edges using clothespins to avoid wrinkles. Place heavier items like towels and jeans at the ends for balance, with lighter items in the middle. Sunlight naturally disinfects and freshens fabrics as they dry. Hand wash delicate clothes. Hand washing delicates preserves fabric quality and extends garment life. Start by filling a basin with cool water and a small amount of mild detergent. 
Gently swish the items without rubbing too hard, then rinse with cold water. Save buttons from old clothes. Saving buttons from old clothes creates a stash for repairs and projects. When discarding a garment, carefully snip off buttons with scissors and store them in a small jar or container. Organize by color or size if possible, making it easy to replace missing buttons on other clothing without extra cost. Use tea bags twice. Reusing tea bags stretches your tea supply without losing flavor. After making your first cup, squeeze out excess liquid and set the bag aside on a small dish to dry slightly. When ready, steep it in fresh hot water for a second cup. This technique uses residual tea flavor, giving you an extra serving. Stretch meals with beans and rice. Adding beans and rice to meals makes them more filling and economical. Cook beans, canned or soaked dried beans, and rice separately, then mix them into soups, stews, or casseroles. Both add bulk, protein, and fiber, helping dishes serve more people. Sew quilts from fabric scraps. Quilting with fabric scraps is budget-friendly and creative. Gather leftover fabric pieces from old clothes or linens, cut them into uniform shapes, and stitch them together. This method recycles fabric while creating unique, colorful quilts that preserve memories and reduce waste, adding both warmth and charm to your home. Collect rainwater for garden use. Rainwater collection is a smart way to save on water bills. Place a barrel or container under downspouts to capture rainfall, then use this stored water for garden irrigation. This method conserves resources and provides plants with natural, chemical-free hydration keeping them healthy while reducing dependency on tap water. Make doilies and covers to extend furniture life. Handmade doilies protect furniture from wear and stains. Crochet or sew doilies from yarn or fabric, then place them on high-use areas like armrests and tables. This shields surfaces from damage while adding a decorative touch extending furniture life, and keeping it looking fresh and well cared for. Reuse gift wrapping paper. Reusing gift wrap saves money and reduces waste. After opening presents, carefully fold and store used wrapping paper, smoothing out any creases. Use it again for gifts, crafts, or as drawer liners. Make homemade cleaning solutions. Homemade cleaners are inexpensive and eco-friendly. Mix common ingredients like vinegar, baking soda, and lemon for effective, non-toxic solutions. These mixtures work on multiple surfaces, cutting costs and reducing the need for chemical-based cleaners in your home. Use leftover coffee grounds for plant fertilizer. Did you know that you can fertilize plants with used coffee grounds? Coffee grounds add nitrogen, improving soil health and promoting growth. They also help retain moisture and attract beneficial earthworms. Simply sprinkle around the base of plants or mix into soil. Cut old towels into cleaning rags. Repurpose worn towels by cutting them into cleaning rags. These durable cloths are perfect for scrubbing, wiping, and dusting. Towels are absorbent and withstand multiple washes, making them an excellent reusable alternative to paper towels. Simple and waste reducing, this swap saves money and keeps materials out of landfills. Make soup from vegetable scraps. Use vegetable scraps to create a flavorful broth. Onion skins, carrot tops, and celery ends simmered in water make a nutritious base for soups. The cooking process extracts nutrients and flavors, creating a rich stock without waste. Strain and season as desired for a delicious, homemade soup base. Repurpose broken items instead of discarding. Get creative with broken items to reduce waste. Use chipped mugs as small planters or cracked dishes as garden markers. Repurposing keeps items out of landfills and provides unique, functional alternatives around the house. Simple adjustments make these items useful again while preventing unnecessary disposal. Darn socks instead of replacing them. Repair socks by darning small holes to extend their life. 
stitch tightly around the hole, weaving thread across to close it up. This reinforces weak spots and prevents further tearing, saving money on replacements. Darning socks is an easy way to reduce waste and keep clothing functional. Make homemade candles from leftover wax. Reuse wax scraps to make fresh candles. Melt leftover wax in a heat-safe container. Pour it into a mold or jar with a new wick and let it solidify. This method prevents waste by turning remnants into usable candles, giving you a simple, budget-friendly way to enjoy candlelight again. Preserve fruits and vegetables by canning. Canning keeps fruits and vegetables fresh year-round. Place cleaned produce in sterilized jars. Add hot syrup or brine and seal with a water bath to preserve. This creates a vacuum, locking in flavor and nutrients while extending shelf life, helping you enjoy seasonal foods anytime. Use baking soda for cleaning. Baking soda is an excellent natural cleaner. Sprinkle it on dirty surfaces, then scrub with a damp sponge to remove stains and odors. Its mild abrasiveness safely lifts grime without scratching, making it ideal for countertops, sinks, and more. This easy solution keeps surfaces fresh without harsh chemicals. Hand-me-down clothes to younger family members. Pass down gently used clothes to maximize their use. Clean and repair items, then give them to younger siblings or relatives who can wear them. Hand-me-downs cut down on waste and reduce clothing expenses, helping families get the most out of each garment before replacement is needed. Make your own soap. Craft homemade soap for a personalized touch. Mix lye with oils, pour into molds, and allow to cure for several weeks. Homemade soap uses natural ingredients, letting you control scents and additives for skin-friendly results. Stretch milk with water in recipes. Extend milk in recipes by mixing it with water. For baking or cooking, dilute milk with equal parts water to make it go further without noticeably altering taste or texture. This trick helps conserve milk, especially useful when supplies are low, reducing the need for frequent grocery trips. Use eggshells in the garden for calcium. Add crushed eggshells to garden soil to boost calcium levels. Rinse, dry, and crush shells. Then sprinkle around plants or mix into the soil. Eggshells decompose, releasing calcium that strengthens plant cell walls, particularly beneficial for tomatoes and peppers. Trade goods and services with neighbors. Barter with neighbors to save money and strengthen community ties. Offer skills like sewing or gardening in exchange for items or services you need. This exchange reduces costs for both parties while promoting resource sharing and cooperation, making daily needs more affordable and fostering local support. Save newspapers for cleaning windows. Use newspapers as a streak-free way to clean windows. Spray glass with vinegar or window cleaner, then wipe with crumpled newspaper for a spotless finish. The paper's texture removes grime without leaving lint behind, making it an effective, waste-free alternative to paper towels or cloths. Make homemade jams and jellies. Turn fresh or ripe fruit into homemade jams or jellies. Cook fruit with sugar and pectin until thickened, then pour into sterilized jars to preserve. Homemade jam captures natural flavors, is free from additives, and can be stored for months, offering a delicious spread made from simple ingredients. Preserve herbs by drying them. Drying herbs preserves their flavor year-round. Bundle fresh herbs like basil or thyme. Hang them in a dry, dark place until fully dehydrated, then store in jars. This method keeps herbs aromatic and ready for cooking letting you enjoy fresh flavor in meals long after harvest season. Learn basic sewing skills. Basic sewing skills make practical repairs simple. Learn to hem, sew buttons, and patch small tires to extend garment life. These skills save money on replacements and keep clothes in good condition. Sewing also builds self-reliance, allowing you to maintain favorite pieces with minimal tools and effort. Brighten white clothes with lemon. Lemon juice naturally brightens white clothes without harsh chemicals. 
Add half a cup of lemon juice to a warm water soak, submerge the cloves, and let sit for 30 minutes to an hour. The citric acid breaks down stains and brightens fabric, leaving whites looking fresh and vibrant. Use salt to scrub cast iron pans. Salt is ideal for cleaning cast iron pans. Sprinkle coarse salt in the pan. Scrub with a cloth to lift residue, then rinse and dry. Salt's abrasiveness removes food bits without harming seasoning, leaving your cast iron clean and ready for cooking. Make homemade pasta. Making pasta at home requires just flour, eggs, and salt. Knead the dough, roll it thin, and cut into shapes. Homemade pasta tastes and feels better than store-bought. This simple process brings fresh, flavorful pasta to your meals using minimal, basic ingredients. Cook one-pot meals to save fuel. One-pot meals were common to conserve fuel. By cooking everything in a single pot, families reduced the amount of time the stove was on and minimized fuel use. Dishes like stews, casseroles, and soups were filling, frugal, and saved on resources. Make vinegar from leftover wine. If wine began to spoil, it was turned into vinegar. Simply leaving it to ferment created a tangy, homemade vinegar that was used in cooking or cleaning. This hack reduced waste and provided a versatile product, extending the usefulness of every bottle. Use clothespin to squeeze out every bit of toothpaste. A clothespin helps get every last bit from a toothpaste tube, according to Grandma. Place it at the end of the tube and slide it forward as needed, pushing out the remaining paste. This method reduces waste and ensures you use the full product without struggling to squeeze it by hand. Use stale bread for breadcrumbs. Turn stale bread into homemade breadcrumbs instead of throwing it away. Simply dry the bread completely, then crumble or blend until fine. These breadcrumbs work well for coatings, meatballs, or casseroles, extending the life of bread and adding flavor to dishes without extra expense. Dry laundry indoors in winter. Drying laundry indoors in winter saves energy and keeps clothes in better condition. Hang clothes on a drying rack near a heat source or sunny window. This reduces wear from a dryer and adds moisture to indoor air, which is often drier in winter. Layer blankets for winter warmth. Instead of turning up the heat, families during the Great Depression would layer blankets to stay warm in bed. Quilts, wool blankets, and even old coats were used to create extra insulation, conserving firewood or coal. This hack saved on fuel costs, keeping everyone warm without added expenses. Make pickles from extra cucumbers. Turn extra cucumbers into pickles for a tasty, preserved treat. Slice cucumbers and place them in a brine of vinegar, water, salt, and spices. Let them sit in the refrigerator for a few days to develop flavor. Homemade pickles reduce food waste and add a flavorful snack. Use cold water to wash laundry. Washing laundry in cold water saved money and preserved fabric. Fill a tub with cold water. Add soap flakes and scrub clothes by hand or with a washboard. Rinse in fresh cold water and wring out. Cold water protects colors, prevents shrinking, and reduces fabric wear over time. Use onion skins for natural dyeing. Onion skins create a rich, natural dye for fabrics. Boil skins in water, add fabric, and simmer to achieve a warm, earthy color. This method uses leftover onion peels, producing beautiful shades without synthetic dyes. Perfect for small projects, it's a natural way to add unique color. Grind stale bread into flour for baking. Transform stale bread into flour by drying and grinding it in a blender or food processor. This homemade bread flour works well in recipes like pancakes, muffins, or cookies, adding texture and flavor. It's a frugal way to use stale bread and reduce waste in the kitchen. Make mock apple pie. Did you know that Riz crackers were used as a low-cost alternative in making apple pie during the Great Depression? Mock apple pie uses crackers instead of apples for a unique Depression-era dessert. Combine water, sugar, and cream of tartar, then boil and add crackers with cinnamon and lemon juice for a tart apple filling. Pour into a crust, bake 
until golden. The result tastes surprisingly like classic apple pie. Make homemade ice packs with rubbing alcohol. Make a flexible ice pack by mixing rubbing alcohol and water. Combine one part alcohol with two parts water in a plastic bag. Seal tightly and freeze. The alcohol keeps the mixture from fully solidifying, allowing the pack to stay flexible for easy application on injuries. Make Chicory Coffee. Chicory coffee is a budget-friendly alternative to traditional coffee, which Grandma often drank back then. Do make mix ground roasted chicory root with coffee grounds, or use chicory alone, and brew as usual. Chicory has a similar, slightly nutty flavor, but is caffeine-free, allowing you to stretch coffee supplies and save money while enjoying a rich, flavorful cup. Make homemade yogurt. Homemade yogurt is affordable and simple to make. Heat four cups of milk until warm. Let it cool to about 110 degrees Fahrenheit. Then stir in two tablespoons of plain yogurt as a starter. Cover and let sit in a warm spot for eight to 12 hours until thickened. This homemade version saves money and avoids additives in store-bought yogurt. Use coffee grounds to reduce odors. Used coffee grounds help neutralize odors. Place dry grounds in an open container in the fridge or sprinkle in garbage cans to absorb unpleasant smells. Coffee's porous structure traps odor particles, making it a natural, affordable way to keep spaces smelling fresh without chemical deodorizers. Buy in bulk to save money. Buying in bulk reduces packaging waste and saves money. Purchase items like grains, beans, and nuts in larger quantities to lower cost per unit. Store in airtight containers to maintain freshness. Bulk buying helps stretch your budget while reducing trips to the store for staple items. Make homemade pie crusts. Homemade pie crusts are fresher and flakier. Mix flour, butter, and a bit of salt until crumbly. Add cold water and roll out. This simple method gives you control over ingredients, creating a tender, flavorful crust without additives for pies, quiches, or tarts. Collect cardboard for future uses. Save cardboard for various household needs. Break down boxes and store them for future projects like crafting, garden mulching, or protective padding during moves. Cardboard is versatile and recyclable, making it useful for tasks around the home. Render fat to make lard. Render fat into lard for cooking and baking, just like how Grandma did. Cut fat into pieces. Heat on low in a pan until it melts, then strain and store in a jar. Homemade lard is natural and adds flavor to dishes, providing an affordable cooking fat free from preservatives. Use fabric remnants for small projects. Repurpose fabric scraps for small sewing projects. Use remnants for things like patchwork, coasters, or decorative accents. Small fabric pieces are perfect for adding color or detail without wasting material. This practice stretches your sewing supplies and makes creative use of leftover fabrics. Make potato water fertilizer. Potato water is a nutrient-rich, frugal fertilizer for plants. After boiling potatoes, save the cooled water without salt and pour it around the base of plants. The leftover starches and minerals boost plant growth and enrich soil naturally. Make use of home remedies. Home remedies are cost-effective solutions for common ailments. Use honey to soothe a sore throat, baking soda for heartburn, or apple cider vinegar to relieve itchy skin. These natural remedies often use simple household ingredients. Use leftover rice for rice pudding. Transform leftover rice into creamy rice pudding. Combine cooked rice with milk, sugar, and a pinch of cinnamon, then simmer until thickened. This quick dessert makes use of extra rice and creates a comforting, delicious treat with minimal ingredients, perfect for reducing food waste in the kitchen. Store cut vegetables in water to keep fresh. Keep cut vegetables fresh longer by storing them in water. Place veggies like carrots or celery in a container. Cover with water and refrigerate. 
This method prevents drying out, maintaining crispness, and extending shelf life, making it a practical way to keep vegetables ready for snacking or cooking. Clean your oven by placing a bowl of ammonia inside overnight. Ammonia softens baked on grime, making it easy to wipe off. Place a bowl of ammonia in a cold oven overnight. In the morning, remove the bowl and wipe surfaces with a damp cloth. This method loosens tough grease and residue, saving time and effort on deep cleaning. Use citrus peels to deter insects. Citrus peels naturally repel insects with their strong scent. Place fresh or dried citrus peels around windows, doorways, and kitchen areas to keep pests like ants and spiders away. For more contents like this, click here to subscribe.